Welcome to Brainstorm MTG, I'm ELD, and this is Fast Effect Double Speed Magic the Gathering from ELD's Time Vault Games in Bellingham, Mass. Here we have the finals of the ELD Legacy Open, Barra on Fun Police versus Dean on Storm. Barra has been playing this red-white hate deck for quite some time and enjoying the new Throne of Eldraine upgrades, Embercleave, and Bonecrusher Giant. Dean actually borrowing this storm list. He is a weekly familiar face Wednesday and Friday night legacy. Not unusual to see Dean amongst the crowd here. And he has borrowed storm on several occasions, often putting up good results with it. And the question is, how will he do on the draw versus this fun police deck which has gone undefeated up until this point chalice at one and chalice at zero and that is a hellacious start gonna need to lean heavily on cabal ritual here we see lotus petal stranded in his hand and now a blood moon three pieces of hate by turn two and at this point, it's starting to feel like maybe Empty the Warrens quick is the uh, the way out from here. We've got a Bone Crusher Giant. And it is swinging for the fences. Four damage in. And now a Chalice at two. And Dean has seen enough. Very unlikely for him to be able to win from there. Not looking to play through that hate. I mean, that, at that point, it realistically, you're talking about Lotus Petals, Lion's Eye Diamonds, and Empty the Warrens. Uh, if you can just draw that successfully over the next few turns, you've got some type of chance. Empty the Warrens can in some way just serve as a chump blocker or you really chump blocking is not going to be an answer you're going to need to get at least the storm of two so you can trade in some of your tokens to take out that uh, bone crusher giant but that was a disaster scenario chalice at one shutting off all of your cantrips and dark ritual chalice at zero shutting off lion's eye diamond and lotus petal cards that i think are often underestimated in their importance. Lion's Eye Diamond very often crucial to going hellbent with Infernal Tutor, especially if you're unfortunate in drawing extra lands. Those are some of the hardest things to get out of your hand. Both of these guys playing for that playmat. It was no splitting in this tournament. Everybody just letting the chips fall where they fall. Our last Legacy Open was a 1K worth of prizes being given out. This one just shy of that. Love to see us get back up to our high water mark. I think the most people we've had here is like 34 for Legacy. I'd love to see that happen again. Thoughtseize taking out that Magus of the Moon. Chrome Mox along with a Fetchland grabbing a Basic Plains and Dean grabbing and now Thalia. I was going to say Dean grabbing that Underground. I'm not actually sure if he fetched or not, I, I don't believe so. Three mana. And now Goblin Rabble Master. And three damage coming in. And this is this is looking real bad. He's going to absolutely need to handle this Thalia as things get closer and closer to the end. Ad nauseum becomes less of a card that can actually win, which forces you to use your graveyard. Something Barra may be prepared for. Is that a Tendrils in his hand? That would not be ideal. 
we've got a lotus or lion's eye diamond and rabble master coming in for four all by himself this is nearly over already next turn will be it he has to answer thalia in all likelihood to combo off A fetch and an abrupt decay prior to combat. So Lotus Petal has to be sacked. Four damage coming in. Dean now down to three life. Oh, and Chalice seals the deal. Barra representing lethal on board. And that is how you win a ELD Legacy Open. Congratulations to Barra. He's been out that list for a long time. Nice to see him get a big win with it. That is all for this one, but don't worry. There is a lot more. Uh, you can check out our older videos, and we're always putting out new videos from ELD's Time Vault Games in Bellingham, Massachusetts. If you want to help the channel, of course, you can like, subscribe, share, tap that notification bell so you can know uh, the next time our new videos come out. Thanks for watching.